Being the first Japanese American to be in the World Cup, I can pave the way for a lot of others. And I'm hoping that they can use me as inspiration and they'll be a lot more like me in future teams and World Cups. If I went to a restaurant and they gave me this, I might send it back. Really? <laughs> How picky you are. Hi, I'm Kellen Acosta and this is Days Off. Today, it was sushi making day. Do you recommend, I'm left-handed, so what, what's okay. the- Okay, you start from this side then. So I go here, I start from here. Yes. Like that, mm -hmm. then and I just- And move your knife up, yeah. That's and great. I like that, nice. Slide it mm -hmm. off. This year has been a year of just exploring and embracing my Japanese side. I think I've really unlocked a, another side of me that I knew existed, but I never opened that door. You're pushing there. So don't, I don't push, push it. Yeah, just, uh, just rest my mm -hmm. hand. Just here, just so, hold yes. it a little bit. So you, you use the length of the knife to slice it. So don't press it too much, but just move your knife back. You are good, yes. When I'm playing in the game, it's like blackout. You can be my best friend, and if I'm playing against you, like, I don't care. I want to win, and I don't mind kicking the mess out of you. And then off the field, I'm a guy that just enjoys great company and making everyone around me comfortable. I'm like two totally different people. My grandma will be proud of me. <laughs> <laughs> Soccer was one of the first sports that I played. I started around when I was four years old. I just fell in love with it ever since. Being from Texas, I dabbled into basically everything. I ran track played basketball, played football, but I mean, soccer had my heart. And how long did it take for you to like master this? Just the cutting? <laughs> Cause it, I mean, I, I don't think it's like a, like a overnight thing. Right, like, right. How yes. much practice you do you know, think, I, do you I've know? I've been teaching 10 years and uh -huh. I've been cutting this like pretty long. When I joined the academy, I mean, I'm in a professional environment at 13, 14, and I realized that it was a perfect fit for me. And after that, I was fortunate enough to go to residency in, in Bradenton. I was there for a couple of years, and when I came back, I was training with the first team, and I shortly signed, signed at 16. So, yeah, it's square. <laughs> it's like sharp, though. It's very sharp square. For me, growing up in Dallas, I really respected Eddie Johnson. He's a local guy. He played for the Dallas Burn, a team that I grew up watching. He was a young player, and, and he looked like me. Just to have that representation, for me, it gave me a sense of pride for starters and made me feel like I could achieve that as well. And then just on the international stage, I, I love Ronaldinho, a guy that just plays with so much passion, so much happiness, so much enjoyment in the game. And that's something that I always wanted to replicate. I just want to enjoy myself, have a big smile on my face and enjoy all the little moments. Just use your fingers to shovel it down, or shovel it up. We have to change See, it to my hands supposed to be this. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to go wash? Yeah, maybe yes, that'd be better. Well, my first year in LA has been great. LA is LA, right? It's beautiful. If you talk about the weather, you talk about you know, the people, the community, it's the land of opportunity. And I've really been feeling that. You can do a little karate chop here. Like a little karate chop here to create a little space to add. Uh... I guess that's next on the list is, is karate lessons. Cause, karate. Because <laughs> it's, not, it's not working out like yours did. This organization has been tremendous. I'm playing with world-class talent and Gareth Bale, Carlos Vela, Giorgio Chiellini. And we were able to pay back the 32.52 with the MLS Cup. Our first trophy in my first year, it's incredible. So you think you're doing good? I think I'm doing okay. You okay? Good, good is probably not a word to describe, but I feel <laughs> like I'm learning a little bit. It's yeah. not perfect, but... Do you think your next career can be a sushi chef? <laughs> <laughs> Playing at the biggest tournament in the world is something that we've all dreamed of. And I worked for my whole life to prepare for this moment. And it's almost here. Last year, I mean, I played over 20-something games. Played in basically every game that we had. For me as a player, I just want to pay that back. Putting on the crest of the national team, representing something that's way bigger than yourself, means that much more. If you were to grade this, A, B, C, or D? A. A, you a. think so? A. Yes. I mean, it's edible, right? So it's I guess. It's <laughs> And it's, if you really shape nicely and you didn't press rice too much, so rice is in a good shape. To be, if and, I went to a restaurant and uh -huh. they gave me this, I might send it back. Really? <laughs> How picky you are. I live in the moment and I enjoy, enjoy the game for what it is. And just like my idol, Ronaldinho, I want to go out there and have fun with it and play with a smile on my face. Should I try it just yes, like that? Yes, go ahead. 
if you want, we can add a little soy sauce. We forgot to add a little soy sauce, but honestly, it's I mean, I would have originally. I would mm -hmm. put soy sauce, but it's not bad how it is. Okay, good. It's not bad. I do things that are kind of out of the norm. I like soccer, which is an outlier. I'm kind of artistic. I'm into fashion. Being unique is cool, and you got to embrace who you are. So I'm hoping that people can utilize my story and kind of implement that in different aspects of their life, whether it's sexual orientation, whether it's interest, regardless of what they're into, just be who they are and don't shy away from it. Thanks, everyone, for watching my video. To check out more stories like mine, like and subscribe. It's not going to be that spicy. You know, Japanese can't take so much spice. I know, spice, you keep saying so. that, but you keep adding spices, so. <laughs>